Yo, what's going on guys? Cinematic and just wanted to start out this video by saying Merry Christmas to all you motherfuckers. Hopefully you guys have a good Christmas. Um, I already let my kids open their presents. I, I honestly wouldn't have cared if they would open them like in the middle of the year. I really don't care, but um, <clears throat> I actually gave my son his presents about two or three weeks ago. But then my daughter, she opened her presents tonight. Uh, that's because I have to work tomorrow on Christmas Day. And um, also because she goes to her uh, grandmother's house and gets presents. So, you know, she'll get more presents tomorrow. Um, but like I said, hopefully you guys are having a good Christmas. I personally do not even care about Christmas. If I didn't have kids anymore, I would not care about Christmas. Because to me, the only good thing about Christmas would be getting together and like spending time with my family and eating and shit like that. But... I have to work this Christmas because the job I am working at does not close. I have to work till midnight, actually. Like, I don't even know why the hell they're open that late. But we'll see how that goes. Anyways, um, in case you guys noticed, I am using this tracker site. I don't talk about the game too, too much. But uh, my operations, I don't know if you guys do it or not. But I, I feel like if I'm going to play Call of Duty Ghosts, I might as well try to get all the operations. Because, for one... They help you um, level up quicker, and for two, some of them also give you uh, your headgear, your armor, uniform, all that kind of shit. Um, so, I seen that one of my operations I had not done yet was for this tracker site, and I put it on, and uh, honestly, I thought it was going to, I was like, oh, here we go with another, um, what the fuck was that thing called? You know what I'm talking about from Black Ops 2. But anyways, it wasn't as bad to me. And I'm going to tell you, I, I don't like it because it takes up so much of my screen and it blocks off everything around it, if you can see right there. It makes it blurry. But you can also click the B button and take that off and go to your iron sights, which this this 2010 I actually use. Hold on, let me turn that off before it starts beeping everywhere. The 2010 I actually use the iron sights. I don't use a red dot or anything. So I was going to say that this is actually a really good attachment for certain things. You'll notice throughout this match, if you're paying attention, some of these guys, like that right there, I probably wouldn't have noticed, even though I didn't kill him, I wouldn't have noticed that guy at first, because the angle that he was at, and he was, you know, I mean, like, he was, like, all up inside of a tree and shit. So the tracker sight does come in handy when it comes to shooting um, people that you really can't see or that are head glitching and things like that, because it's like an oracle, because they'll, like, they'll glow orange or whatever and show you that they're there. And I actually have used this for about three matches now, and, uh... I have a hard time aiming with it, like, close range. Look, I don't even know how I died there, but... Close range, I have a hard time aiming with it because, like I said, it blocks my vision around me. But it, it would be a great thing to keep on if you run into a bunch of lobbies with head glitchers. Look at this lag. Look at this lag. Lag. Call of Duty Ghost. Lagging away. But anyways, what I was going to say is if you, uh, if you have room for it, if you're running something where you can put it on, it actually comes in pretty handy if you just want to flip to your iron sights and only use that when you run into matches with people head glitching and shit like that. Because when they're head glitching from far away, all you have to do is look down that. And it's kind of like a thermal scope, but I hate the thermal scope. So to me, it's like, um, I don't know. It's, a better, it's better than a thermal scope, but it does the same shit, if that makes any sense. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Back to Christmas. I am an old ass fucking man. And, um, all I got for Christmas was my mother. <laughs> I, I'm 36 years old. My mother still gets me Christmas presents every year. My mother actually gave me, like, $20 gift card to Walmart. She was going to give me more, but I told her to just give my kids more stuff because I really didn't care to get anything. Um, she did also give me $50 this year for my birthday, so... You know, you can't really beat that, I guess, at my age. I, I don't expect to get anything. Most people my age get, like a bag of socks or something silly like that um but you know i, I got something so I, it's all good it's whatever like, like i said now now i'm more about doing stuff for my kids and back back to what i was talking about about giving people presents early I, I really think that it's silly that you know starting in like august or september we'll stop uh most parents will stop buying their kids shit look and see this see i wouldn't have seen that guy on there um most people they stop buying their kids any kind of things at all and they like wait till christmas wait till christmas so they spend all this like you know two or three months some people go out the last minute and do it but a lot of people go out two or three months before christmas 
and they start trying to stock up on the presents and things. And honestly, the Christmas giving like gift part, I honestly don't want to do that anymore. I would rather just buy my kids something every month. Like maybe not nothing huge, but like every month or two just buy them something that, that they want instead of making them wait. Um, I don't know. I, I just think it's to me it's better because I don't like the ideal of Christmas as giving presents to me. That's just not what Christmas has ever been about for me except for when I was a kid. So as younger guys, which I know a lot of you guys are, what do you guys think about that? Would you rather your parents get you certain stuff throughout the year? Um, because a lot of people don't get, like, it would be different if people were like, oh, it's Christmas, Xbox One, or, you know, Xbox 360, or PlayStation 4, or, you know, something really big. But most parents don't do that. They get you a bunch of little stuff anyways. They might get you a couple games and give you a gift card somewhere. And, you know, like, it's a bunch of littler stuff. And wouldn't you rather just get more stuff throughout the year than have to wait till the end of the year for this big thing or whatever? Um, I don't know. Just give me your thoughts on that. I'm going to hop off here. The game is over. I didn't do, like, the best in the world, but I did. I think I did have, like, a 5KD, and I got, like, 15 tags or something like that. So, whatever. Bah, humbug. Bah!